UFO book collection, which I was never able to substantiate. Many UFO researchers believe Nixon received specific briefings, information he may have wanted to take public. There's some very good indications that he planned to reveal data, that UFOs, past, present, and future, a book by Robert Emenegger, a television program that was done with that title. I talked to Emenegger, and he got asked by the Republican Party to produce that show using only government people, because the idea was they were going to release data. Bob Emenegger was an advertising executive and television producer who happened to know an important man inside the Nixon White House. Bob Halderman was someone I knew from UCLA Beta House, which is a fraternity. Then, as you know, he went on to be chief of staff under Nixon. In the mid-1970s, Emenegger and his partner researched military stories for their TV production at Norton Air Force Base's film archives. Paul Shardle is the one who took us in there and said, what would you think if we told you we had a landing at Holloman Air Force Base of an alien craft, and it was filmed by our TDY, our temporary duty guys, and the film was sent here to Norton, where all films usually are sent. And I thought, this sounds outrageous, that, uh, you know, uh, UFOs and all. He said, well, look, if you're interested, uh, check with the Pentagon, but bury those under those other projects because it's a red flag to get into the subject of UFOs. George Weinbrenner was the commander of foreign technology. He has a private bunker down at Wright-Patterson. I went down the long hall, I could see all the little uh, cameras, surveillance cameras, walked right up to his desk and said, I want to ask you, what about the landing of an alien craft at Holloman Air Force Base? And I sort of expected him to say, what? The what? He didn't. So he reached up, pulled out a book, handed it to me. So I opened the book up and I said, to my friend, Colonel George Weinbrenner, signed Dr. Alan Hynek. And the book was all on UFOs. Well, Hynek was the, the uh, scientific advisor to the Air Force at that time on UFOs. Perplexed, Emenegger contacted his friend and Nixon's chief of staff, Bob Haldeman. He was at the White House. And I asked if he had heard anything about the landing at Holloman Air Force Base. And he said, well, I heard something, but I don't know. Whether the president knew, I have no idea. While Emenegger never obtained the Holloman film for the 1974 nationally broadcast program, his firsthand experience provides researchers insight on what American presidents may have known about UFOs. A friend of mine helping me out talked to two ex-presidents. They both confirmed that they had been shown the Holloman Air Force Base film. 